Well, welcome back to another Cyberpunk Let's Play. Uh, we are continuing where we left off on the last episode where we just got some cybernetics put in with the doc over there who seems, I think he's just shouting at a TV over there. Um, but I think now we are going to talk to Jackie and see what is happening to him. I think this is actually the way out, but thanks for the, uh, oh, my headphones are really loud. Um... Yeah, we're just going to leave him to watch some TV and head upstairs. Um, quickly between the episodes, I just dismantled a few of the weapons we picked up and put on our best ones. So we're currently sitting... I think the only better one I had in general was a the special pistol that we got just before getting the cybernetics put in. But we've got an assault rifle and a shotgun sitting on. But let's go see what is... Uh, what's happening with Jackie? I think he's still just chilling here. Black, babe. Hey, buddy. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, and yo, listen up. I talked to Dex <laughs> up, while bro? you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his Thank ride you. for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, I don't know where to talk us up. But I guess we're gonna head on outside. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the last uh, two episodes. There should be two up on YouTube now. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we are heading through to. There's Dex up there in the car. Oh, hello. V, What's up? Listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly right. how that sounds. But I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip yep. about a possible okay. attack, I'll give you a call. Oh, what's happening? Maybe you can investigate. Oh, God. The the what is happening? But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick Wait, up. Okay, so who are the bad... What is happening now? So you're a patrol officer. What are you? What are you? Are you good or bad? Um... I think... Oh, yep, definitely bad. Oh, God. Okay, performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street kids to make a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. Well, I guess that street cred is always a good thing, isn't it? Uh, so let's... Is that... Are we good? Oh. This gun definitely shoots a bit quicker than the last one. Hey! Are you? Are you... You're not trying to kill me, are you? Another... Oh, I see. Behind me. Is that high? <laughs> you okay? Are you alright? Um. Like, feels a bit mean. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, damn. Uh, don't worry, guys. I got you. Oh, we're continuing the phone call. I hope that's all clear. How do you. Can I. Can I get. Can I get the loot? Please? Um, okay, there are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal, non-lethal, non-lethal weapons, takedowns, quick hacks, uh, EMP grenades, and weapon mods that d change damage to... Ah, oh, you can get non-lethal uh, weapon mods. Interesting. Um, forgiven weapons, combat gadget. Quick heal, there's non-lethal damage will be mentioned in the description. Alright, well, I'm just trying to get whatever this lady, I think. Oop! So we can't... Get whatever that is. Okay, we're just gonna move on to the next person and just get a bit of loot from our end. And then we're seeing power weapons. Oh, power weapons allow you to control the direction of bullet ricochets. Oh, mad. That's cool. Um, uh, fear ballistic stuff. So I need to get an uh, optic to be able to use that gun a bit better and a bloody knife. Okay, cool. Let's just get all of the things and we'll sort that out after, I think. Um, are you alright, mate? I can't loot that last body. So mad. Um, what are these guns? Should we put one of these guns on? Is there inventory? If we go... So we must have a new assault rifle then. So that was what that was, right? Is that the tech one? It must be. So that one is 63. That one is 60. So I guess we'll put on that one there. And what is this? Uh, I'm using another tech gun, I think, though. So that's uh, ricochet bullets as well. Does the other one have the ricochet mod? Okay, cool. Alright. So we've got a couple of ricochet guns and then that power shotgun thing. Alright. So I need to get the mod to see... Can I get this from here? 
Oh well. Alright, let's go see Dex. See what's happening. Huh? Uh, my man, what's up? Uh, thank you. So oh, the door opens the wrong way. Okay. That's cool. That's cool, though. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun no in the flesh. Worries. Ample indeed. In the flesh. <laughs> Let's roll. <laughs> Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Oh, far away. Would you rather Why live not? in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Um. Uh, Hello, maybe it's all that counts, Mr. Nobody, so I. So I'm saying, is this some, some sort of test? test? Eh, just a pet topic of mine. You mean. riddles? No, Mr. V. Ontology. Alright, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Turn my headphones down. Uh, that was awkward. Uh, tell me Let more. Me What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a court. <laughs> Mm hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. It's no problem for me. <laughs> Corpse don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Go wrong. Got a plan? <laughs> Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Alright, alright. Um What's the issue what's needs the resolving issue? with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Okay. Got a classic tale for you. Oh man, Psycho Gang That's doing cool. his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. Okay. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. But they in charge now. And I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstorm, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Oh, okay. Royce guy. It was What's Royce. Like? A straight psychopath. Chrome loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, <laughs> first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. That's the too much information, mate. But thank dog. you for that. Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Chair Bear? Oh, Klein. sorry. <laughs> What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway. That's it? Our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. 
yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. Uh, got cool. I think we... Time I got to work. <laughs> that we good. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. All right, all right, all right. Are we just, no just driving? One more thing, Mr. Cool. Oop. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? <laughs> blaze of glory. All the way. I can't can't say that. That's it. Later now. Oop, well, yeah. Thank you, sir. Alright. Oh, put that away. Level up. Alright. We've got some points to Jackson, use. Oh, we got a phone call. Yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally and not yet. Yeah. Oh, my car as well. This is happening. Um. Uh, what is it? Big deal. Yeah, yeah. The guy soon knows how so to go. Let's take this. Wants to put us Oop. in a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. This. Oh, it's got to turn that radio off. There we go. It's combat bot. Military right, continue, prototype. Sir. Maelstrom clepped it. Oh, there the we go. decks paid oh. to take it off their hands just before the gangrens had to switch up in management. Oh, I should stop trying to skid around. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> on. Okay. Um, then there's the other thing. there's this whole other Gotta thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. I think that's where we're heading next. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on Probably. the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Um, start with the clients. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods, put my nose to the ground. It's the ground. It's the Luego. Later, bro. Okay, let's head through to. I'm going. If we just tap the. Nope, yes, maybe. Alright. See how well we can up the sensitivity on the driving, and I've already messed my turn off. Uh, back around, yes. Please, camera. I think I got that, and it'll flick around. There we go. Just gonna cut that corner. Don't worry about me. Sorry. All right, so we are heading to the thing to meet a client, and oh, head that way, and talk about uh, getting this chip. Alright, if I just cross over to the wrong side of the road. And skid on. Look at that parking. Nailed it. There we go. Alright, I think. Okay, this is closed. So to be here between 6 pm and 6 am. So if I. Nope. Yes. Let's skip some time. What are we. Two hours? Up. Oh, can you go up, please? There we go. And confirm. And that should take us to 616, and the club is open. Voila! Been a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Sure. Sure. Uh, I'm in. And I go. Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and around. get yourself a box. Yeah. I really love that going green. on over there. Oh, like I don't know. All right, getting distracted. Mm -hmm. Doors open. Have fun. Milady, thank you. Welcome to Lizzie's. Right, what we got here? My. Really what a read some of these. Uh... Face you have. Thank you. Okay, we are hidden through. Um. Oh yeah. Look at this place. Nightclub's not a thing uh, around at the moment, are they? <laughs> uh, Alright, we're going to see hey. my man. 
get you something. That's close. Can you social distancing, please? It's 2020. You're not allowed to do that. Um, it's on the menu. Yet. Oh, it's just devs. Oh, 21st stout. Hmm. Yeah, I think we just got to talk to him. Well, there we so, go. So, curious. The name Lizzie's. Is that the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, eyes. insured, even had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Uh, Till? Let me guess. It didn't last? No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad ones. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. The gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big Boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. Biz booms to nice. this day. Oh, it's busy. Anyway, we are looking Parker. for Evelyn. No, she's here. Who's asking? Hmm. I guess we Name's should just, V. Uh, there we go. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, oh, it's a pleasure. Yeah. I'm okay, there. Uh huh. So, Evelyn. Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Oh. Hi. You gonna stay anything? Or are you just gonna stand Evelyn there Park. awkwardly? Oh. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. I, don't, I feel like it's really zoomed in. Can I like unzoom in? Should we let's try some tequila? Let's see if that helps. Oh, all it's down in one. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky cool. guess. Cool. Stalking me. All right. Uh, well, oh, we've got a little special. Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like dialogue. A this place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on, know a place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. Sasha. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. Thank you, sir. I do, oh, you can't tip him. All right, bye. Thank you for the so, tequila. What can a Jeez, horny power walking to. Really? All right. Why don't you just tell me the truth? Little... Then we go. I guess. I guess it's me first. Oh, do I have to? I'll sit down. Oh, oh no. What's that? Was this something yet? Oh, I don't know. I've not picked it up. You gonna? Dex Sit. had a load to you say about you. Stand awkwardly. He called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope Who's lying about me? You're selling. Uh, <laughs> I'm the best. Yeah, let's do that one. I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew on my back, too. Never once botched a job. You do realize Humble I as well. expect more of you than... Scraping street corner data terms. Much, much more. Best into. Dex was clear. The job's high risk. Oh, okay. By the way, you work together long? You and Dex? Background. If you've got headphones on, the, the background music is great. Uh, what you write? <laughs> writing Dex's bio? Yeah, so. Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you uh, for this job. Hmm. Phrasing. Curious. No doubts. Let's, uh, let's, let's just go straight chase. into this. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arisaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm hmm. Arasaka's poured billions mm -hmm. into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? 
yeah, a bit out of my price range, mate. Classy Corp hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Be interesting to see how the dialogue changes, obviously, when you change, like, the different classes. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? What are they? Uh, yeah, I bet he's that much money. He must have a lot of people like guarding us. Like bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu yes. keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Intel. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Uh, so we're not jumping he's the, the target? We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you mm. spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell Stealing things? Stealing a stolen thing. Um, no. All right, we're fine. So Where no is he Arasaka keeping it? Security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Likely in a specialized container, one that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Uh, yeah. Alright. What, what else, else you know oh, about do you know anything else? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. <laughs> Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path. And so has his own designs on the corp. All right. Um, Seems to be risking yeah. everything with this relic scam. Yes. Because he's fallen for the biggest lie this town puts forward. That he can gain and retain control of anything. Okay. All right. What's next? What's next? Now comes the best part. Follow Talk me. To me. I got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance How? supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. Did we get this? I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Yeah, yeah, I'll Jacking off too in Would those you boxes. Like anything else? No. I don't know. It can be a very useful tool. All right, good for Mom. analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. All right. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? But you've been in there? It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. It means you were inside. You know each other? How else could you I get all this other? intel? I know him pretty well, actually. 
We have an arrangement. Ooh. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will oh, help. I thought we were going that She's way. She's a right. too. Besides, we go back uh, years. It's like machine. What? Dee, this is important. Oh, who's, always who's been for me. Okay. Always helped yeah, out. Was Hetman. Right, I trust right, her. All right, all right. But she's a mox, <laughs> not the latest right. member of your crew. Can I move? Is it? <laughs> so, silence the lady boy. shouting at me from beside. Tread lightly and keep that tongue on a leash. But lads, I promise you not. I'm no stranger to tact, in biz or life. Hello there. <clears throat> Hi. Yeah. Hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Oh, we're just gonna quickly loot some stuff around here. While you guys talk away. Oh, I'm supposed to do something. Oops. Welcome Hi. Um compiled your BD oh. What do you I'm think? Supposed to say Will it do? Miss that. Pretty raw. But yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So Crazy. let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip? <laughs> I I'm sorry. Not. Was I boring you? Wait, there's some stuff to loot around. I was just having a wee look. Um, what's so raw that? about it? How does this differ from the ready mates? Huh. Ready mates, provided they're well made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. Here is like literally. But it's mass market shit, so it's pre crafted, hard coded, fenced in, and manageable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. You get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. All right, all right, all right. Uh, okay, we're just in there. In the chair. Hi. Got to create your sensory profile first. <laughs> cool. Okay. Uh, profile away then. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. Hit me with your It won't. Shot. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. Oop. Okay. Now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. It's an eye exam. Oh. That almost feels like I am getting an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. I'm excited. Pain receptor limiters in. Pain receptor. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where can we? Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. All right, let's give it. Should we choose? go. Uh, what'd you choose? Corner store hold up in Haywood. Real amateurs. Don't even know where I got it. Suits our needs perfectly though. You ready? Yeah, let's do this. Let me give you the tailored version first, let you get your bearings, and we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, oh, that's cool. one. And into the matrix. Even more. Then it feels like we already yeah. Uh, 
and it's loading. Well, hopefully you guys have been enjoying these uh, these episodes. Just a friendly reminder to drop a like right in the comment below while we wait for the loading screen to load into a, uh, a BD of a corner store holdup. Plan simple. That's bright. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. <clears throat> got it, got it. And remember, Roger, Roger. everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Thanks, sir. I guess we're hitting on in. I'm not controlling any of this. This is just a video. Now, everybody, on the ground. Wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money, now, or I will fucking drop you. I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off. Ooh. For the Rubik's Cube. The four fighters Rubik's Cube. Oh, okay. That was a lot. I am not even really sure what just happened. I think we're going to get to go back into it, though. Oh. Oh, we're out. That was, uh, a lot. That flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. You could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me. Real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about <laughs> that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. Oh, back in we go. Cool. Better loading screen here. Oh, there we go. That bright white light again, and we're back in. Okay. Oh. So we can just kind of like check around. Oh, okay, so not that far by looks of it. <laughs> so analysis um, mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Okay. Do so play. Odd. Don't get creative. And pause. Play bit mode. Okay, so we jump between them and out, and in. we can play and Smash pause. The cash. Get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. We just got to got find a pause on what's happening. Right? Roger, Roger. No, that's not all. Yep. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Got I, got I. Rewind. Wait, Roll it back to the top. Oh. All good. Neat. Now try fast forward. Now fast forward. Plan simple. Oh, Do left trigger and then right trigger. Easy as. Okay. <laughs> you can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Oh. Now for some oh boy. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD oh, I keep leaving the zone. Here's some stuff like heat. popping and out over there. The I'll zoom in though. Okay, so we just kind of zoom in. So the, where is the gun? It wasn't far though, was it? Oh, was that it? Oh. I can't go back, so I imagine it's still full. Alright, he's not got it out yet. Okay. I don't realize most of this clip was just him getting the gun. Oh, we go. Scanned. Close. Alright. Let's move on. Now, heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer oh. in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay. Okay, good. We are in now that. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. 
Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, so I can go here. Okay, Down fuck. to a human. Ah, little shitheads. Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? <laughs> so, <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, pop. explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Got one here. Can I scan? Oh, it takes a while to scan it. Go restock. I'll take the register. And a how about you suck a bag of dicks, okay. eh? We have a deal today on two flavors. Cuddy and no. surf and talk. Everybody! Oh. oh, okay. And then that's Sometimes it. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the rollers cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Okay. <laughs> Hello, nice. Now that's let's wait cool. till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. The grab! Push forward. I see you kissing the flooring! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded oh, chick. Uh, Try scanning. Awkwardly, how do you get... Alright, walk up. You mean fly. Awkwardly, for right, dear. next thing. Scroll forward to the bar where our artist gets a lead injection. Okay. Oh. This one's just slowly falling to the ground. Oh, yeah. Oh. Let's see. Oh, I can't go back. Oh, you can go back there. Uh, all right, we should probably head forwards. So we're going to get where we get shot. Where does my man come from? Oh, around the corner here. Just out of... Is this the guy that was getting told off for stocking the shelf? It's just super mad. Is that the guy from outside? See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Oh, that's cool. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Uh, Must have okay. caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screens okay. in the kids' field of vision. Then scan it. Okay. Hey there. No, almost. There we go. That a dude from outside? His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Uh, yeah, I don't, think, I don't know if there'll be too much else we can do in this, so... Did he? I guess we can't actually go out here to see... That's oh, nope, you get sent back. The reality recorded by the BD roller. <laughs> the editor won't let you outside it. Make sense? I mean, that makes sense. All right. Let's head on out. Did I do? Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. And we're back. Too bad most of the BDs oh, that, we do here are only That's a really cool view. Log. Anyway, <laughs> you ready to do this? Raise it. No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when. Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it Must together, be weird please. to be able to feel okay. through something you're seeing okay. by essentially Go ahead. Just being the person the in that recording. Kid. Whoa, 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 who? Runner for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it seems is like a it might be. Not what like we it are definitely is. <laughs> uh, Judy. Yeah, you can trust T-Bug's professional, discreet to a fault. I you assume. Trust her. One would hope. Why? Cause you say so. Yes. Please, Judy. Exactly. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, V. 
Call T-Bug and he'll dial in. Uh, Alright, let's give it a call. Hopefully hey, that's a What's good watch on the stream there. Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, I thought as much. Someone there with you? <laughs> Yes. Yeah, yeah that's just how it is. Chill. They helped me work through this BD. Uh huh. All right. Uh huh. You gonna tell me what this is about? <laughs> Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. That easy, apparently. Opening port one seven seven nine. Secure protocol. I guess it must be able to hack a lot. If everyone's got implants, the implants in. must be hackable by Should people. Should be getting my requests. Now. Oh, that's just coming up on my. You ready? See, just seeing this I'm through his eyes. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Imagine just being out and about. Dance. Somebody just hacks into Fire you. Fire up, Judy. Ooh, that is bright. Well, I might. Oh, I pause that there. Oh, I can't do that right now. All right, we're watching this video. <laughs> you look like a cup of fuckable meat, are you, Evelyn? Yeah. She. <laughs> I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick too. I said pretty cool though. No. I. Nope. Oh, okay, can't do that now. Looks like we just uh. Then. You should Isn't perish true? for good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Uh okay. Let's get in there. There. There we go. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks involved. My father's involved. a tired, visualless old greybeard who he thinks nothing will change. To his. And he'll live forever in his tiny, frozen bubble. I should not <laughs> even be listening to such oh. things. So let's be over here. Well, listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot. So you gotta stay by, but you can still hear all the conversation. From reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists of a world that may never have existed we have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years i am quite sure we want now read the documentation carefully the relic requires specific storage conditions you must know it them. heard that relic docs got to be around here somewhere look for them okay well, we've got whatever this is can't, okay, I think I can only look for the relic dock. So I guess we just. Uh huh. Nope. Don't see anything. Uh, there it is. Whatever that is. Can we scan that? Yep. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig Camera. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access <laughs> to their subnet. Bedroom. Okay. Nightstand. I've got an idea. You're that. Some more scanny things. Nope. Must be some more scanny things. I can see one, two, three, but we need to scan stuff in. Alright, what is in there? That looks like something. Manual details a special temp controlled container. Relic needs okay. to be kept real cool. So, chips got real to stay cool. in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you're going to keep the chip. Can I scan that first though? No, apparently not. Um, I want to scan, can I not scan the thing? Oh, I can, I just have to go back. Uh -huh. Safety's okay. off. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about the iron. 
Let's go back to that other one. Oh, God, that music's ominous going backwards, isn't it? Okay, we're, we're over here somewhere. There was a thing there. What is that? Automated turret. Automated Some more security system. Latest scanner model. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Thing. We got thermal. Done that. Nope. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka <laughs> had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Yeah, yeah, Just never know. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Thank you. Not really much else around. I think we're gonna have to go back and scan the robot. I don't know what the last thing in the recording is. Guess we'll go back to that. And then it's over here. Hmm. What's that? Fridge? Just a fancy ass fridge. Just a fancy ass fridge. Won't find a thing here. Okay. Oh, what is that? Right. Hidden safe. Right. That seemed suit. very much like. Matches the spec in the docks. Okay. You're no then we have to go back. Here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Mm -hmm. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. I've got to do a thing first. So I think it's just one more at the start. So that is there. And then, oh! I go back and scan so we get rid of that. Is that the only thing I just scan or something else? Why won't you scan? Can I... Oh. Oh, there's a thing there. There's one. Alarm fresh, but... Saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling through this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security oh, cool. systems are linked to the hotel subnet. Oh, what's up? We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Okay, let's head on. How do I head on out? Nope. Oh, there we go. That just takes me straight out. Silence on the loading screens. Well, that was a pretty cool editor to go through and do. I like that. Getting recordings and then going back through with like a moving need. camera. Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cache sure, and bro. the data. You were never here. Oh, thank you. So that is coming through on the stream there. Keep I think it. It's catching I'll up now. put it on Ev's tab. Portable device oh, so for kind. handling VDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. This must be a thing later on in the game. Not We're as gonna have to do a bit worse. what we got here, but should do the trick. And so what if we can record our own? Way. Or we can get cybernetic upgrades to actually Speaking of harm's way. Be able to you know use what that. I see looking at Walking, talking corpses. Yeah. We needed that recording, Judy. The BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy. She's probably Max. dead. <laughs> she got the recording. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Uh, alright. Stand. Awesome. Well, as long as everyone hey, doesn't start talking straight sec. to me. Yeah, I'm probably gonna end that episode there. So, um... 
we will continue on. There's a bit more of a cinematic episode that's... Um, sorry, not a lot for me, just because there was so much talking and uh, like movie play in this. Uh, but hopefully you've enjoyed that. If you have, uh, you know, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching.